What's up, everybody? Anthony, come back at you with another video. Hope everyone is doing well, as always. I have been busy. I've been back to work out of quarantine for, I want to say, about five weeks now. Uh, we started off at 25% capacity at my bar, went up to 50%, and it has just been nonstop crazy since we were open. People have wanted to be out. Been putting about 65 hours a week right now, and it's been busy. Um, so yeah, let's uh, not waste any time. Let's get right into the video because I have a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff to show. Um, pretty much everything from products I've opened to pickups to a collection purchase to just everything. Uh, we'll start off with the collection purchase because I'm not going to go too much in depth of it. I uh, got contacted by a guy on Instagram who saw a couple cards that I had for sale on eBay, a couple bigger cards. And honestly, I'd been sitting on them for a while and he said, hey, would you be interested in this massive lot uh, for one of your cards? And I kind of looked it over and I thought, you know what, why not? It's a great amount of show inventory, definitely stuff that I should be able to move rather than one card that I've been sitting on uh, for about a year. Uh, it's been listed on eBay, so I went and moved for it. Pretty much everything that is top loaded has been sorted already. And then everything that is penny sleeved is not. So stuff that is top loaded is sorted and priced. It is all rookies, inserts, just some really great stuff. I don't want to go into too much detail because I don't want it to take forever. Let me just grab a stack here and see what I can find. It's got like a Byron Buxton gold to 20, I'm going to say this is 2014 or 2015. Um, Baez rookie card. Tommy Fam Heritage card. Like I said, I'm not going to go into too much detail. Judge Stadium cl uh, Club, a blue Xander Bo, uh, just even Xander Bogarts, uh, Jackie Radley Jr. Uh, just so much to absolutely go through. There's just got a variation Bryce Harper rookie. Just a ton of stuff. Another Baez, Shohei Otani. Just a lot of stuff. So, yeah, just a lot of stuff. Great show inventory. My first show uh, since quarantine uh, is actually next weekend, so I'm really looking forward to uh, that. I haven't set up a show in forever now because we haven't had shows. Uh, moving right along, I guess I'll go into some stuff that I busted. Uh, since my last video, I've opened up a lot of Gypsy Queen. Gypsy Queen has always been one of my favorite products to open. This year, I got hosed. <laughs> I opened up a ton of retail and then after just pulling absolutely nothing, retail, 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 and just getting nothing. Uh, last year I did pull that um, Jackie Robinson Day auto of Anthony Rizzo out of retail after not going the hobby route. Went the retail route again this year and just got absolutely nothing. Went the hobby route and got absolutely nothing. So I already have all the autos that I pulled. They were nothing big. That's already all sorted into my... Uh, into my show box. One set that I'm doing, something I did over um, quarantine, was organize all of my sets. So I love this tear to the game set. So I'm doing it again this year. So th I haven't bought a single one. These are all pulls. And I have like one double of Pete Alonzo and one double of George Springer. But I literally pulled like one, two, three, the Boba Shet rookie, four, five six i think i have a double of the chapman eight nine ten you got the mike trout eleven twelve i think i have the double of the third Furland, verlander already so that just goes to show i haven't even like picked a single one up and i've already have that many others that complete with doubles so just toss that on the side just another insert set that i'm working on uh so yeah Let's get right into the mass amount of pickups that I have. Healthy stack right there. A uh, couple Dybal Dybalas that I got. Um, soccer has been absolutely blowing up. Cards are going for stupid money. Uh, obviously the prism craze uh, that was in basketball and football has now gone over to soccer as well, as well as top, top chrome refractors and just 
cards that are worth like Mbappe base cards that were lower three four dollars are now going for 50 60 bucks it's crazy the amount of stuff that's been going up so i picked these up before the craze because 2018 world cup was a product that i did not open and um now it's starting to heat up obviously with the Mbappe cards and other players just having stuff very rare and i'm glad i picked these up early because a lot of the numbers stuff is already starting uh to catch up with this guy so i did pick up a paulo dabala uh, prism and then this is really awesome we're at 25 the green cracked ice so those are very awesome both going into the bgs pile and this which is already redeemed from uh panini is the select signatures of Paulo dabala so starting to pick up his stuff again as well uh, moving right along into Marco Royce, got a ton of it. Um, actually, you know, let me pick this, show this off first. This is non PC, saw this on auction, could not let it go for as cheap as it was. I have picked up this guy in the past as an investment. I think he's just he's a very good player. I think he's at his peak, not very highly collected, but his stuff sells for so cheap that I feel like why not pick it up? And if then the interest is out there, I feel like I can get something for it, trade it. Uh, for something I could use for my PC. And this was definitely a card to do that with. It is from Topps Chrome, the Super Fractor of Marco Verratti. So I picked that up for a really cheap price. Uh, moving right along to Marco Royce. I was originally going to steer away from this product just because I've been more picky with my pickups. But I saw some of these cards in person and they're absolutely gorgeous. It is from Obsidian Soccer. I picked up the base out of 165. The purple, which is out of 65. The orange, which is out of 35. And the green, which is out of 25. So awesome stuff there. Uh, moving right along, picked up a bunch of just older stuff of Marco Royce that I didn't have. There'll be a bit of a trend when you see this card. Uh, this is from Top Scrum Champions League, the first year they did it. The orange refractor out of 25. Uh, a member on Blah opened up a bunch of Bundesliga Chrome because the craze with Kai Havertz right now. His stuff is blowing up. And he just asked me for my address and said, hey, I pulled some Royce call. Let me just send it your way. I didn't have any of this stuff because I just kind of avoid this product because it had the same design as this, like the uh, the format that they used. So I was like, eh, it's basically the same product with a different picture. But the Chrome design on it, I like the, f this is all the same color. This kind of has like a fade on. I actually like it a lot more now that I have it in person. So really happy to have these. Got the green to 99. This is the blue to 199. And then he did send me the orange out of 25. So that's really awesome. So yeah, really like the color on these. Like the faded out. So definitely gonna looking forward to chase that rainbow. And more people open the product right now. Hopefully the one one pops up. Uh, another pickup, got this on the cheap, have a lot of the rainbow already over on ComC, so got a request shipment, but this one popped up on eBay, number 25, the orange refractor from last year's Champions League Chrome. Uh, next card got hit up on Blowout, guy had this card, gave me a great price for it, and it's actually my first autograph of him from this product from Topps Finest, the orange wave auto, numbered out of 25. So more orange, super nice card. And then also from Top's Finest, this card popped up on, on a buy it now for super cheap, could not pass it up. Numbered out of 10 with a PSA 9, the Red Refractor. Last but not least, went to the LCS today to stock up on supplies. They had tier one. Tier one has always been a favorite product of mine to open. Uh, at the price point that it was at this year, I just could not see myself opening any of it but got to the lcs saw that they had it the ripping addict in me had to grab a box so pulled an aaron nola jersey a robo garcia rookie auto and a xander bogart's autograph so after that box i was like you know what screw it there's still five more boxes on the shelf let's grab another and I knew that the auto was on top, so I kind of like tried to steer away, put the top auto on the bottom, and that's exactly what I did. Jeff McNeil jersey, Aaron Savali auto, and this card would have been on top and saved the best hit for last. Super happy to pull this guy. Number 299, a rookie autograph of Gavin Lux. 
So awesome stuff all around. Try to make this as quick as possible. I hope everyone is doing well. I hope everyone is staying safe. And as always, thank you for watching.